morning everyone. It's six in the morning. We're just up. I had a good night's sleep. I really had a his the bed's really comfy. I went to bed around I guess seven thirty, way down. Slept till about one, got up, went to the bathroom. One to three was wide awake pretty much, but then from three to six I slept again, so in good shape. Today's plan is we're gonna have uh, breakfast at six thirty, head out for a walk up to uh, Lama Hotel and that'll see what get up to the adventure there for breakfast. I'll show you what I'm going to have for breakfast. I think I remember I picked a type of uh, Tibetan bread with some honey and uh, um, a masala tea. So stay with me. Okay, so here's the breakfast there. We have, uh, Michael's having an omelette and coffee. I added the uh, the masala tea, which is very good. This is the Tibetan bread, and then honey. And then, what are you having? Uh, uh, apple pancake. Apple pancake and tea. Oh, yes. So now we're gonna get stuck in, and then next stop is for heading on the trail. Okay, so here we start on the day two of the Lang Tang Trek. <laughs> Just leaving our tea house. Namaste guest house. Here's another one. Morning. Morning. <coughs> a monkey? Okay. Yeah, here we're heading off. I'm gonna turn it off for now. As you see up there? Those are beehives. Annoyed for the Himalayan honey. And then the mad honey in it. So people have to actually climb up or climb down. I like it. There's water features, waterfalls coming in. Right along the trail. As we make our way up. This beautiful Thursday morning. Okay, so we're just taking a quick break here. Get some water, much needed water. It's, uh, we're going about 45 minutes now. Yeah. And uh, it's nice to take the well, pack off the back. And, uh, you know, it's getting there. It's, it's hard work, it's good gaff though. Uh, if you wanna challenge yourself, I, I'd rec highly recommend it. Okay, we're having another break here. It's a beautiful sight here. Now we had a little issue. The donkeys came up and I had to get on the side and I tried to get on the side to get the camera but I slipped and I had a little bit of damage. But I didn't even feel it so I feel grand. I think because they're carrying a 15K backpack and I don't think about it but it's gonna have some water. So this is bamboo. Can I take a view? Yeah. Beautiful, huh? Very nice. So I ordered a ginger honey lemon tea. We're gonna add the bamboo, we're gonna take a break. And then we're heading off to our uh, our next place for the lunch, which is the uh, Lama Hotel. So we're gonna take this is what is on the right site. A bit of water, the sound. And this is constantly going. So when you're sleeping at night, it's like a constant like soft noise. Definitely get your exercise in it.
all the good smell the tea houses. So we're just taking a water break. A lot of people on the trail now. And uh, we're still going on. Continuing along the path. Heading to our suspension bridge over the waters, the gushing waters. <coughs> the path is. Uh, Hard in some spots and then easier in the others, and you sort of have to take your time, stay your pace, and uh, make sure you have good footing. Use the poles, the poles are God sent. Walking across. Yeah, no, you hold this. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. You face it like to me. Yeah. So go there and then I'll walk to you. And put where? No, 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 no push. push? Okay. It's on. Okay. Just go there. You go there. Yeah. And take oh. a picture of me like, like walking. This? Like this? Yeah, wait, do the top and I'll walk. Suspension bridge. I'm planning on going to uh, Kentucky Golden Bridge, which is the longest suspension bridge like this. It's 574 meters long. So make sure you subscribe and hit that bell button to get notified when it gets posted. That'll be coming up in the next few weeks. So looking forward to that. We're coming up to another tea house now. So this will be what, the third or fourth this morning? They're all usually located right along the river. So they always have that melodic sound of the river gushing around you. You always get goodies, handmade goodies to pick up. This is where we're walking along the side. I'm going up. All the way up. The donkeys finished their day. They're heading back towards Saber Basin. Carried up their gear. Usually it's about 120 kilos they carry. Just showing you the beautiful bamboo surrounded by us all. If you notice, I don't have my backpack on. I had to subdue it, give it to one of the porters. Um, you know, basically in my mind, I think I'm 22 still, but I'm almost 60 in the body. So it is very hard to climb. Um, like you're going straight up, zigzagging along. So if you do come to Lang Tang, which I recommend, make sure that you uh, have a guide. And porters 
because they do help you in situations where if you are feeling tired or your legs are getting cramped or something like that they can help you so I uh, recommend that it's a beautiful day too the weather is really hot though I'd like it a little cooler coming into the next tea house here we are there's hot showers So we are 25 15 meters Here's what it looks like Here we are. So we're just eating this. I'm having dal bat again. Third time in uh, four meals. So it's doing pretty good. Today, after we finish lunch, we're heading up. I think we have another two hour hike to the stopping place for today. Here's my friend, look at him. Carry in the backpack. He has what? One, two, three. Three backpacks. We're heading off. We're going to get started on the uh, the next phase. About a two hour hike now. Just walking by here. We just left. We look at the views. The GoPro picks it up. Like, surrounded by these beautiful mountains. And it's so warm and humid. Anyways, we keep going. So we made it to the next stop. We're just as we're passing through Lama Hotel. Like, it's a little city there. There's a bunch of different guest houses. It goes around, but we're just stopping. We haven't gone that far, but we'll just keep on going. I think we're after a few minutes break. Climb up and down, mostly up, a few downwards. But look at this. We're about almost 3,000 meters right now. So that's been a tough one. Uh, feels like I've climbed Ben Nevis twice today. Um, we're coming in onto a tea house I think we're staying at today. We were supposed to stay at the Nama Hotel about an hour and a half, two hours ago. Um, but we're pushed on to Try to make the best of it. So here we are, coming in. I'd have to say it was really tough. Um, you know, not undoable, but you wanna prepare and uh, raid equipment, make sure you have hiking poles, proper footwear, because you walk through a lot of water and stuff. So here we're coming in to the guest house and we'll see what it is and what it's like and hopefully we'll be stopping here for the night I know there's another one down the road they were wanting to go to but we'll see here, here we go coming right in so we're at Riverside here's some rooms Riverside, horse riding available, elevation 2770. So basically it is double in Nevis. So. Yeah. Namaste. Sanjay Hanahanta. Ah. <laughs> Ramro. 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 <laughs> okay, I'll be changing the battery now. Well, just been told we have another hour and a half to go to our break for the night. It's about 3.40 in the afternoon. So it's been a long day. We started at 7 in the morning. And uh, yeah. My feet are 
a little bit in bits. My heel's really sore, so I'll see what it looks like when I get the boots off in an hour and a half. But definitely challenging, but you know, when you're finished, you feel great about the achievement you did. But when you're doing it, you're cursing yourself. So here is the last little place we came up to. Uh, Riverside, 2,769 meters. And then we're continuing on. It's a lovely place here though, by the river, hence the name Riverside. You can go for a swim in there, I think. <laughs> I'd almost be tempted if we were staying here. Some little friends. to the uh on we have to wait wait yes okay we have to wait because yes, wait. the yak is eating the okay yeah we got this is grazing away we're not too far from the G's house when we get there I'll let you know what time it is and how long we'll walk. So we're almost there. This is in there 10 minutes or so. So basically we'll be getting in around 5.30. So basically that's walking 10 and a half hours, which is long enough. But imagine walking 10 and a half hours and then having an incline of, you know, 3,000 meters. That's what we did today. And of course you're going up and down, up and down, so it feels a lot more. This is the last suspension bridge. And we have a, another hill to come up, as you do. And uh, turn back on when we get there. Okay, here we are. Coming up to it. Yeah, What's it called? Gorata uh, Bella. Gorata Bella. We are now Gorata Bella. Very good. What's the height, the altitude? Yeah. So we'll make our way in. That was a tough one. Welcome to Hotel Tibetan. Doesn't look open. Here we are. 3,008 meters. I'll give you a bit of a room tour. Sitting down because I'm too flipping tired. So here's the two beds. So myself and Michael. And the good news is they have a hot shower here. So I would definitely be partaking in that because we didn't have one yesterday. 
and uh, I'll see how bad my feet look. Um, yeah. So we're going to have supper a little bit later. So I'm going to take a rest a bit, get changed, have a shower. I'll show you what's for dinner. Okay, shower's down. Just having some water. And here's the menu. Here's the type of prices you get. So, tea is 120, small pot. 480, hot water, 50, porridge, and what says for breakfast. And then, here's the prices. They're from 400 to 650 here. And then there's soups from 400 to 600. A packet of soups are from 350 to 500. Potatoes, they can go up to 700 from 500. Momos, chow mein. You got rice, dobat, pizza, pasta macaroni, salad, pancakes, fruit bowls, cold drinks. So bottle water is 350. So 350 is around 250 euros. Um, and they have some alcohol here, but Nobody really drinks it because uh, you're uh, too tired for um, the walking and then the room charge. So we'll just wait to see what I've ordered the um, the fried rice, mixed fried rice. Hi there, just finished the dinner. Forgot to it'll turn it back on. It was uh, a veg fried rice, very good. And I had a ginger tea with uh, lemon uh, and honey. So now I'm just showing you a quick room tour. Here's it all set up. I'm just gonna get my sleeping bag out. And we get up at six in the morning to start our day. See you tomorrow.